guys welcome to this video by nation i hope you feel that i've stolen this bad nation thing from transformation nation but anyways my name is moyo if you're new and you're so welcome to she bites this channel is all about food faith and lifestyle and we're still in our christmas and new year in nigeria series where we're doing a few really really lovely nigerian recipes that are dear to me that i love so much and i hope that you can use in this holiday season or whenever um today i'm going to be showing you how to make nigerian beans potage guys i love beans like the palm oil beans that we make as a child i hated it like i hated beans so much but now i love it so much it's a super super simple recipe um that's just made with beans onions palm oil and seasonings you can also add corn to make adalu and you can um you can also use black eyed beans if you're in the diaspora also if you're wondering what you can eat these beans with it to be gari, you can eat to be bread. Like, <laughs> whenever I eat beans in the evening, the next morning I have to eat beans with bread. So, or you can just eat it as itself. It's a composed meal. You can add crayfish, you can add, um, you can also eat to be rice actually. You can add crayfish, you can add different kinds of fish, you know, fresh fish also. And yeah, but this is a really simple, really lovely recipe that I hope you try out in your own kitchen. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Bye. So for the ingredients, we're using 500 grams or 2 cups of brown beans or brown honey beans, 1 large chopped onion, half a cup or 4 tablespoons of palm oil, then salt, pepper, stock cube, chili flakes and bay leaves. You can also add stock fish, dried fish if you would like. So to start off, put your beans, your onions, your salt and your bay leaves in a pot and bring it to a boil. Just add enough water to cover the beans. After that water has cooked down for, after it has cooked for like 20 minutes, check the softness of your beans. As you can see here, my beans are still very hard. So I added the same amount of water, just enough to cover my beans. Then I left it to cook again for another like 15 minutes. After this, you can see that my beans are much easier to break apart. They're still not 100% done, but then they break apart very easily between my fingers. At this point, you can add your stock cube, you can add your palm oil, and you can also add, you know, if you're adding fresh fish or anything else like that to your beans. And then we're going to continue cooking for about 20, 25 minutes until the beans is nicely cooked. At this point you can mash it with a spoon as I'm doing here or you can just take some and um, taste it to ensure that it's of the right softness that you would like and that is it this is such a simple recipe but the flavor profile is amazing especially if you add like shrimps crayfish um, smoked fish it just takes it to a different level I hope you've enjoyed this recipe and I hope you try it out in your own kitchen beans are really high in fiber they're really good for you they are a very good source of protein and they're just a lovely addition to your diet. They are served with some ephoro and some sliced onions. Thank you so much for watching guys. Bye!